Okay, so in the last movie, what did we find? We found there's 84 ways to choose three digits out of nine. We found there's 84 ways to choose three digits out of nine. But, yeah, with, but order matters. Because these two things are different numbers. Okay, so let's say here's my nine digits here. Mm -hmm. And I just selected a group of three. You... What does that, what does that, now that I've selected, let's think about, let's not think about the whole problem on its own. Let's just think about, now I've selected a group of three digits. What, you can make these digits be whatever you want. In fact, let's, let's use what we have written on the board. Let's say blue is three. Let's say green or yellow is what? Six. 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 And orange could be seven. And orange could be seven. Okay. So I've selected... A group of three digits. Yeah. Okay. But they're 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 not a number. They're not a three digit number. They're just here's my group. It's a group of it has a seven, it has a six, and it has a three. So what does that mean now in terms of the numbers I'm trying to count? Well, six numbers have this group. Six, there's six numbers in this yeah, group. Yeah, that can be made from that. Okay. Good. So there's six three digit numbers that can be made from that. That's good to know. But only one of them is in increase and is in strictly increasing order. Aha. Uh -huh. Exactly one number and only one number. Yeah. It's in strictly increasing order. Is in strictly increasing order that we can make from these three digits. So that means if each time we choose three digits out of nine, we get one number that we want. Aha. Uh Aha. -huh. Uh -huh. Each time we pick three digits. We get a number that we want. We get one of the numbers that we want. And we found there were 84 ways to do that. Hmm. So that means... To pick three digits. To pick three digits out of nine digits. So wouldn't there be 84 numbers? Interesting. Hmm. 84 numbers. So this shows the power of these counting numbers. Yeah. Remember back to the beginning when we said, oh, there's going to be lots of cases and we're going to have to do all this casework? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's pretty simple with these. But wait a minute. When you see, when you, when you see what's going on here, any set of three numbers that we pick out of nine, because remember, we can't use zero. Yeah. Any set of three we pick out of nine gives us one of our numbers. It gives us these other numbers, too, the five other numbers that don't work. That's okay. We're not worried about them. But it just makes a group of, there's a group of six numbers, one of them works, and that's one of our numbers. And if I pick a different set of three numbers, do I ever overlap? Do I ever overcount? No, no. Because you're picking a different set. Because I'm picking a different set. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so this, this was, this, I, this is just kind of spur of the moment, but I, this I wanted to show you a surprise. This is a surprise. Mm-hmm. You don't have to break us all problems up into these little cases and just and try to count and count and count and count and count. It's sometimes you can see on this it's going to be hard, and you can also see it's going to be hard because we have 84 cases. Yeah. Or maybe not 84 cases, but lots of cases that are going to add up to 84. But if we look at it from a slightly different angle, what do we find? It's pretty easy it's simple. to do the calculation. Well, sure. After the fact, it's simple. Yeah, but it seems. It's you've got this, you've got six, num six numbers, and one out of those six is one you want in this, when you pick a group of three. So it's easier than the casework. It's much easier than the casework. So there's 84 numbers and that have the strictly increasing digits. Strictly increasing digits. There's 84 times six numbers that have different digits from one to nine, hmm. right? Because each one mm -hmm. of these represented six numbers. Yeah. So we found a lot of fun stuff. All right. That's, that, that's why we're learning to count. Because sometimes these choosing numbers really come into play and show you some fun stuff. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Good work this morning, guys.